Hey, before this video starts, I just want to mention, if you want to commission me for a video posted here on YouTube, come over to when I stream either here on YouTube or on Twitch at Retro Mario Twitch. But, let me not take up your time, enjoy the video. We finally got the last one here. And Maskey is nowhere to be found. Oh, great. It's like every time we do this, he's always doing something different. It's whatever, though. So listen. Oh, you don't have to know who I am. You're not going to remember anything after this. Why are you here? Well, that's... I can answer that quite simply. You're here... because we need to get someone back. Well, he's been gone for, uh, quite a while now. And... It's our job to make sure that people know of his existence. Spread the word of him. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about God, you fucking idiot. I'm talking about someone who is more powerful than that. Someone who can actually get some fear into the world. Mm, close to saying, actually. I mean, he's one hell of a boss, so I mean... If that makes any difference, then yeah. He's basically Satan, incarnate. Well... My associate was supposed to be here to help me resurrect him. But... It's clearly seen that he's not here right now. Which is kind of a pain in the ass because he does this every goddamn time we do this. It's happened before, yes. Usually he doesn't have enough power to come back, but with enough sacrifices... ...and this uh, little summoning circle we have here... He comes back. He comes back stronger than ever. But uh, he does need a host of some sort. So that's where you come in. I'm not the one that you should be begging for your life for. I mean, I'm not gonna kill you. No, I'm not gonna kill you. I'm just here to bring someone here. Yeah, I'm fine. Just had a little scratch on my back. Well... To resurrect our boss... Our powers get a little bit more stronger. Yes, powers. You see, I have tendrils that I can summon at any time I want. It hurts, but it's still there. Ah, uh, well, like I said, you're not going to remember anything here. So you could say that I'm a demon of some sort. I mean, do you look, look at me? Do I look like a human to you? All right then. 
You know, doing this job is a lot more easier if you were to shut up. I'm not trying to hear you. Beg for your life and ask for mercy. I'm not the type of guy that gives mercy. I'm only here for one reason and one reason alone. To resurrect my boss and cause more chaos. You got that? <laughs> That's funny. Last time someone offered me money to get out of the situation, they died on the spot. So no, I don't want your money. With everything that you try to give me, it's going to be futile. Because I'm not here for money, I'm not here for any sort of thing. Matter of fact, I was asleep. Yep, I was asleep not even a few minutes ago, but I woke up to check if you were still here, and lo and behold, you're still here tied up sitting in this summoning circle. So I think I'm doing my job correctly. What did I just say? I don't give a shit. Now sit there and sit pretty while I wait for my associate to get his ass here. <sighs> You're a real blabbermouth, you know that. Fine. I'll tell, I'll tell you, you our names. names. My name is Hoodie. And my associate that's supposed to be here, his name is Maskey. You want to know why he's named Maskey? Because he has a mask. Something our boss gave to him to give him power. He gives him strength and... Stamina and whatnot. While I was cursed with a black body and tendrils that are unhuman like. Similar to our bosses, but less powerful than his. It's like a gift he gave us for helping him come back to life in some way. Although there is a third one of us. His name is Toby. He's the kid of our group. Well, he's not really a kid. He's just younger than both of us. And our boss gave him immortality. It's a kind of fucked up joke because the kid wanted to kill himself. But now he can't. Really funny, fucked up sense of humor our boss has. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah. And that's why you're here to get our boss back. Because without our boss, well, we don't really have a purpose in life. And he's still out there, alive somewhere, barely. Because we still have our powers, so that means he's still alive somewhere. Probably not physically alive, but his spirit is still alive. And that's why you're here in the summoning circle, so we can give him the body that he needs. All we need to do is just kill you in the circle, and then he's going to be here. 
really easy job for the both of us. Me and my accomplish. And he's supposed to be here, but he's late. And I don't know if uh, he's going to come or I'm going to have to do this by myself, which is going to take a lot out of me. And I'm hoping for the latter. So, yeah. Hmm. Oh, there he is. You took long enough, Masky. Oh, come on, hoodie. I was just having a little bit of fun before I got over here. So, what do we got here? Ah, I see. We can have our little sacrifice for tonight. Let me take a good look at him. Let me take this off. Hmm, yeah. Yeah, he's... I, I, I think that they'll be good. I think they'll be good. You know, you're not supposed to really call them by that. And who's going to stop me? Hmm? Not you, obviously. No. Let me take a good look at you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna you're gonna be good. Alright. So do you have everything set up now? Mask uh hoodie. Hoodie. I think you can handle it yourself. I'm gonna take a nap. You're always taking a nap during these things. Fine, fine, fine. I'll do it myself. So, sorry to have you here all so suddenly. I'm pretty sure my associate here was trying to, uh... Calm you down in a way. Tell you how this is going to happen. Right, 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 right. You see, because, um... We need you for our boss, and, uh, well, he's not here right now because, well, I don't think he's alive. <laughs> but we are still here, and we still have our powers. So, that's why we decided to try to resurrect him in a way. But, the last time I tried to resurrect him, I needed a body. And, well, Hoodie here was so kind enough to get me a body. And your body is the body that he got. So, in conclusion, you're going to die here tonight. <laughs> oh, don't, no, 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 no. Quiet, quiet, quiet. No one's going to hear your cries out here anyway, so there's no point of yelling for help or anything like that. No, 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 no. Just accept your fate. After all, you're going to be bringing back a great person. <laughs> you see, our boss is, uh... He's a bit more on the magical side. Because, well... You know that uh, little uh, folk tale that everyone was talking about a few years back? Oh, well, not many. Maybe like 15 years ago, something of the sort. He was described as a very tall man. He always wore a suit with a red tie. And he was pale like paper in the skin tone. He didn't really have a face. No eyes, no nose, no mouth, but an imprint of a mouth where there's supposed to be one. Because he does talk. He doesn't, he's not like a mute or anything like that. He does talk, but his voice is a little bit, uh, how do I say this? Demonic, in a way. He's more of a demonic spirit. Oh yeah, we're using it to summon a demon here. 
But our demon is our boss. And our boss is, well, in control of us in a way. Here, let me take this off and actually really talk to you. See, this mask here is a gift from him. This mask is a part of me now, even though I can still take it off and take put it on. But this mask, uh, he gave it to me. It gives me all sorts of special power. Sometimes it gives me strength, sometimes it gets me utmost speed. And other times I get lots and lots of stamina from it. In other words, if anyone tried to escape from me, well, <laughs> I just had to pop this baby on and boom, I become this unkillable creature of some sort. Although I don't change in any way, shape, or form, I'm still like this. But this mask gives me enhancements. Does that make sense? Am I making sense to you? Fantastic. Good, good, good. Now, before I kill you tonight, there's just a few things that uh, I want to talk to you about. So, when it comes down to it, you are dying tonight. But, I would like to be nice for once. Yes, I don't usually do this, but this is a special occasion. So, if there's anything that you want me to say or pass or like push forward to like your family or anything like that, you got a family? I see. Okay, well, you want me to pass over something to your mother, your father? Your dog. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Okay, okay. Anything else? Nope. Alrighty then. You hear that, hoodie? Make sure to pass that on to their parents before they pass away. I would hate for them not to get the message about their... Oh, so precious child dying in the woods by themselves. Now, that wouldn't be such a great thing to notice, or even see on the news. Well, I don't think that they're going to be noticing you on the news, because your body's going to be used for our boss. So it's like they, you just went missing, that's all. Sure, they might send out a search parties and whatever to try to find you but it's gonna be too late for you so yeah anyway let's get this sacrifice on the road shall we <laughs> oh, you're gonna pray really you're gonna pray right now how much of a fucking idiot are you? You're in a satanic ritual. A summoning circle. You really think God is going to be your outcome? <laughs> oh, I used to be a stupid human like yourself. I'm still human nonetheless, but I'm better. I'm stronger. And I'm smarter. But you're not going to remember anything here. So, and put this little boy back on. Ah, I do love my job. So, any last words before we uh, get this started? You're still gonna pray, oh, fuck me. All right. human they always think that god is their outcome huh or you done yeah i think i'm done here and luckily the blood's getting into the 
circle. So let's just sit back and watch our boss come back, shall we? Like we have a choice, is it? Ah, <laughs> I can feel, I can feel his power surging through me. Can't you, hoodie? Yeah, I feel like this is a little bit, it's a little strange to refill this feeling. Oh, but it's such a great feeling, is it not? <laughs> I guess you're right. My proxy. Such a 